I had some very long conversations with Randy Harvey mm -hmm. a couple of weeks back, and I found him an amazing guy. He's brilliant. How did you run across Randy, and how did you ever persuade him to help you? <laughs> this guy had never given a public speech before, or a professional public speech. I videotape all my speeches uh, when I'm in Toastmasters, mm -hmm. and I videotaped one of them, and a woman came up to me afterwards and said, can I send that to a friend? I said, sure, absolutely. Well, her friend was Randy Harvey, the oh, 2004 wow. world champion of public speaking. He sees my speech, and then he emails me and says, um, come over, I have some questions to ask you. And I went over to his house, and he goes, why do you want to win the world championship of public speaking? And I told him, he, he's, he said, I told him, you know, I'm ready to do this, I can do this, I'll give you everything, and I'll give all of my energy, I just don't know how to do it. You ever been there before? You know you want to do something, you just don't know how to Absolutely. do it. And he goes, I'll coach you, but you have to promise me something. And I said, okay, what? Can I know before I promise it? And he says, you can never give a speech again. You can only send a message from the heart. And that's what I have stuck with for the past two years um, after I've met Randy. And anytime I speak or I get on stage, I remember those lines of, if I speak from my heart, I can't lose, and that message will stick because I, I'm using all of my energy and I'm using my passion and I'm not wasting people's time. That's terrific. I've been reading his 101 book. Yeah, uh, just, Messages That Matter. The, it's a great the, book. A fantastic book. Mm -hmm. And as I'm reading it, I'm getting chills. Uh -huh. He and gave me that book as I was going to, as I was training for the World Championship, he hadn't finished it yet. And it hadn't been published, but he gave me a, a manuscript to read as I was training. And that really helped me win the World Championship of Public Speaking. And that's what Randy's all about, is love. When you meet him, he's, it's, he's overwhelming because he is so smart, but then he's so down to earth and he's genuine. And he's just one of those guys where you just want to hang around with more because he shows you how you should live your life. He's. I'm so glad I have him in my life. The question, I guess, one of, one of the drawbacks of winning the world championship mm -hmm. so early is people will say, oh, you're so young mm -hmm. to have that achievement. How can you possibly have the world experience? Did, were you an old soul of some kind, do you think? Well, that's a good question. I think you can teach at any age. I don't think you're ever too old to learn. I don't think you're ever too young to teach. I think what's important is if you're focused on a message that's important to you and you share that message, people will listen. People are ready to. I was reading, and I, I'm sorry I don't remember who it was from, but he was talking about the two syndrome. You're too old, you're too young, you're too poor, mm -hmm. you're, you're too something. But that's such a lie. You're never too something, you're ready now. Jim Rohn taught me you're never, it's, it's not about being great to start, you have to start to be great. And what happens is people have this mentality of thinking, oh man, I don't know how to do that. Well, of course you don't know how to do that because you never <laughs> tried it or it's not instilled in you. Uh, for me, it wasn't. I had to learn how to communicate and speak, talk uh, with purpose and engage my audience. All those skills can be learned. And thank you so much. Is there anything you. else you wanted to say while you were here? I just want to say thank you for having Chelsea and I here. I, it's been great so far, and we've only been here for 12 hours. <laughs> so I'm excited to get to the workshop tonight and meet other people in the district and to teach the workshop. So thank you for having oh, we're, me. Oh, we're looking forward to it. I'm bringing my daughter tonight. So great, uh, great, great. It's going to be kind of fun. Wonderful. So forward. Thank you thank so you much. Thank you so much. Thank you. This is Peter Coy for District 60 TV. We'll see you the next time.